It's a telling sign of the problem. A Missouri vaccination clinic empty, vacant chairs waiting to be taken, and COVID vaccines ready but left untouched. Tonight, we're seeing signs pop up more around the St. Louis region that we are not winning this pandemic. The new Delta variant behind the Missouri surge now positively identified in Jefferson County. And as we've seen where there's one, there's many more. News 4's Russell Kinsall is in Arnold tonight learning about new efforts to stop the spread of the virus. Well, right now here at the Jefferson County office in Arnold and across the county, health officials are using a variety of different tools to get people vaccinated, to get them to use precautions so that they don't have a crisis here like they're having in the southwest part of the state. Six. The sales brisk and the broths hot. At the farmer's market in Hillsborough, the fresh vegetables are a big seller, but not everyone here or across Jefferson County is sold on getting vaccinated. This is Angie and Leon Brook. You are... I'm vaccinated. And you are not. In Jefferson County, only 30.45% of eligible residents have been vaccinated, or 68,000 people. That leaves more than 185,000 who are not vaccinated and at risk. And that's at a time when the positivity rate has topped 10% putting Jefferson County in the orange category. This is not where we want to be. Um, we kind of saw this one coming a little bit. We've seen a steady increase with our cases over the past couple weeks. And with the first Delta variant case confirmed here, Jefferson County health officials know Delta is working its way through the population. We know that Delta variant has a higher transmissibility rate. Um, we know that it can lead to more severe illness. The health department believes there are still people who want to get vaccinated, so they're using their mobile vaccination vans to take the vaccine to food pantries and businesses. In the past week or two, I've been getting a lot more questions of where can I get vaccinated? And the staff is taking to social media regularly to answer questions in hopes of overcoming vaccine hesitancy. And they're reminding those not vaccinated to keep using preventive measures. We are hopeful that with preventative measures like vaccination and masking and things, we can kind of curb this. So it takes anywhere from two to five weeks to do the testing to confirm that somebody's COVID case was caused by the Delta variant. So there are probably a lot of other cases out there. So they're hoping to head it off before this variant, this, this, this variant of the COVID virus causes a big spike in hospitalizations here in Jefferson County. Sam. All right, Russell, live for us in Arnold tonight. Thank you.